Hi, Adam. So here's, here's the current mast situation. I'm going wide here to give you an idea. That's the mast, the tall silver thing. It's just a um, cleaning device from Home Depot, very lightweight aluminum. Um, and I've got it mounted to a bo boom bobber in the middle, which isn't so, it looked, it's, it's loose, you know. So I wanted to get away from that a little bit. And in the bottom, I stuck it into the boom where I had, a, this used to be where my boom pole was. So what I thought was I would eliminate those things, put a, a um, 5 8 spud here. This is very thick and sturdy. Um, and there's plenty of room to, to get it up there. And then, if, if, and if I put it at the right, exact right place, I can um, also uh, secure the pole some way here to, to the nose of the cart that would give me two related, I mean, this, this cart, you know, is, is sort of loosey-goosey. Uh, shaken around, so I need to mount, have two parts that don't move around relative to each other on the cart. So we have this that is uh, integrally related to the nose, the frame, and the, and the nose part. So if I attach at those two points, that it should be a fairly, fairly sturdy little thing. So here at the top. This is where the antennas would presumably, well, no, they could actually come, come from the bottom, from, from the wires, from the rack along the bottom and go in here <coughs> at the, toward the bottom of this, of the pole. And it would just really be a matter of figuring out a way that those, ca those stupid RF cables that aren't very flexible. I don't know. I don't know, sweetie. If it were, if the cables were, if the cables were coiled, but I don't think they make coiled RF cable. It would be antithetical, wouldn't it? Hmm. But I like, I'm really liking my Cardellini clamps, man in a big way, big way. Here's the other mask solution, by the way, since I have you here. And that is another Cardellini clamp here to the back with a stud adapter. And this really, really heavy duty gooseneck um, for the far side. So I just, you know, I can fold it down, but it really holds its shape um, under, under stress. And it's really, really, heavy duty as opposed to a, uh, a mic stand or mic gooseneck that's very loose. This is a grip gear that I kind of took apart and bastardized to, to go on this Cardellini. So that's the other mast. I just usually find I need one, one being having the option to go high. You know, seems sufficient most of the time, for now anyway until the RF spectrum gets really, really um, more challenging. Anyway, there you have it.